I attended the regional conference in Thursday Island last year and it was too short a time and I thought I needed to learn more. I had that yearning to learn more about politics and I thought, and I heard about this one in Canberra and I thought, I need to go there. <laughs> I need to be there, yeah. And I really wanted to come and network again with Aboriginal women to see what's happening across the nation, what people are actually doing and working towards. To be able to get a better understanding of political issues that, that are happening in our government seeing that they have a great impact and have always had a great impact on Aboriginal lives. Straight Talk is talking straight. It's about saying we want to see this real change and we know how to get there but we just need a bit of support with the right tools you know, to share with each other what's worked and what hasn't. But really it's about facilitating women to be more effective and more strategic change makers. We learn really specific tools about how to break down problems, but also how the political system works, how to make a plan. Often our women know the solutions to the problems that are happening in our communities and it's about you know, breaking those things down and actually making those solutions a reality. My passion is working with youths, disengaged students. I'm a registered nurse and I've done a bit of clinical work um, but I've actually switched over to Aboriginal Community Health. I really wanted to come and lobby for more staff and more funding because we've just seen a steady, constant increase in the STI rates and it's causing a lot of problems for our communities. On the first day it was just a sort of little information here and there and then the second day, mind-blowing. It was something I learned every day, but the thing for me was the lobbying skills. You know, the importance then of making sure that if you have an issue, you do your research on it, you look at what's actually been done before. Finding out the commonality, what, what do we agree on, what can we move forward on. And being able to communicate that really clearly. And the more that I'm doing it and the more that I'm talking about it, the clearer and clearer I'm becoming about what needs to be said and what direction to go in. I was really lucky to be accepted in the regional Stroke Talk program in Keynes. I ended up helping one of the ladies lobby to become a council rep and to be able to help her through that um, was something that we learnt from the regional conference. It's given me an opportunity to really find my voice and I now have a really clear vision in my mind of where I want to be and what I want to do when I get back to my community. Yeah, I think we just get, you get so caught up when you're in community and especially when you're so far from Canberra and from that political arena. Um, you know, sometimes, I, I know I felt before I came anyway, like I was drowning in negativity, drowning in what couldn't, couldn't be done, whereas I'm um, definitely going back to the community going, this is what can be done, this is what I'm going to do. And we've all made a conscious effort that we would like to keep these relationships going. It's important to continue building that strength and sharing those stories. These tools that we learn here at, here at the conference, it, there's none of this in our community. But coming on board and coming into this conference and gaining that skills and the tools, that will make a change. I want sustainable programs to come in, things that make a difference and can change, have the opportunity to change their lives like Straight Talk did.